twist rear end cap firmly to unlock position and remove it. Loosen the star knobs under the bracket approximately three full turns. Connect the XLR tail from the com box and place your mic into the liar clips. The liars have a soft grip to avoid noise and damage on the mic body and the interference tube. There is no problem in gripping the interference tube as long as the rear ports of the capsule are not obscured. Retighten the star knobs under the bracket. OK, let's listen to the MKH4 and 6 and see how the liars perform. Loosen the star knobs again and slide the windshield on. If the spine sticks, loosen the star knobs a little more to free up the filler strip. Retighten the star knobs once you're happy the windshield is fully on. Check the mic is positioned correctly by removing the front end cap. The front of your mic should be no further forward than the plastic ring on the windshield to achieve optimum performance. At the back, make sure the XLR is well within the windshield and the tail loop is clear of the end cap and twist clockwise to lock. 